Just a few days ago, these students left Mason City for the National Invitational Choral Festival in Washington, D.C. The 78-member choral group received an invitation to participate in the exclusive competition. But as they wrapped up their trip, an invitation from Vice President Al Gore gave the students a little something extra to remember. After hearing a recording of the talented singers, Gore invited the choir to sing at a special luncheon at the U.S. State Department. Um, we're really nervous. <laughs> we're really nervous. It's really exciting to be able to do this. We weren't expecting it, so it's really just pretty nerve-wracking right now. All nerves aside, the group not only performed in front of a private audience, it was a special reception for Japan's Prime Minister, Kaizo Obuchi. It's kind of exciting that we, can't, we didn't even come down here expecting to do this, but it's neat that we get to represent our country kind of in this way, an artistic way. The rare opportunity left the choir with feelings of pride and honor. All the students are very proud of representing Mason City and representing Iowa, visiting Vice President Gore. And they were proud to visit Vice President Gore, but now they're very proud that they're not only representing Iowa, but they're representing our country with the, vice, with the uh, Prime Minister of Japan. Now the students return home to Mason City with top honors from the festival and memories that will last a lifetime. Amy Fleming, News Channel 3.